Hi yogis, welcome. We are finally getting to the end. It's day 23. We're going to play with some one-legged variations. Find a good attitude, no balance is tricky, and grab a light set of weights. Hi yogis, let's begin in child's pose. Send your knees out wide and your toes to touch. Rest your arms long and melt your chin down towards your mat. I want you to breathe through your strong body and know that you are enough just as you are. If at any point that you need to rest, please do. Although we're not here for a whole hour, it's just 20 minutes. It doesn't mean that you might still need to restore. So rest amply and breathe fully. Find a big breath in and a full breath out. Tell yourself you've got this. Rise to tabletop pose. Good, and find cow-cat pose. Plant your palms underneath your shoulders, lift your gaze and then round through your spine. Draw your chin to your chest and press your mat away. Good, articulate the spine to warm it up. And exhale, press. One more round. Then find your tabletop pose. Inhale, tuck your toes. Exhale, downward facing dog. Send your hips high to the sky. So pedal them to your downward facing dog, bend the knee to the next. Nod your head no, and nod your head yes. Really want you to find one line from your tailbone to the crown of your head, so come up as high on your tippy toes as you need. Find a big breath in, and a big breath out. Inhale, shift forward to high plank pose. Tap of a push up, so pause, and know that you can come out of this at any time. I want you to build strength, micro-bending your elbows. Good, and we're gonna start with a toe tap to the right and left. It's a right tap and a left tap. Good. So this is familiar, we've been here before, and um, no, there's a plank form, it gets really hard really fast. So you can drop one knee and just focus on one toe tapping or stay with me. Good, we're gonna stay and tap, tap it out. Exhale. This is when you notice, are you holding your breath? Just tap and tap. Good. Stay strong. You've got it. Belly's on for eight. Both sides. Seven. Hoorah. Six. We're going to hold the plank and lift our heels straight up. In four. In three. Little lifts to the sky. In two. In one. Keep holding your plank. Little lift of the right heel. Tap. Lift of the left heel. Tap. I know, it's hard. Just lift. Straight up. Like your toes stay down. Lift. And lift. We'll find our knees to our chest. In four. For mountain climbers. In three. Slow or fast. In two. And one. Knees to chest. So knee in, knee in. Up, knee up. You can stay slow or pick it up. Let's go. Yes, I want you to exhale, my fierce friends, for eight, seven, six, five, just four, three, down dog, in two, and one, downward facing dog. Now that the shoulders are fired up, big breath in, big breath out. Inhale, look forward, exhale, bend your knees, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, the halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Listen, take your feet hip width distance and take your hostas, your hands, and slide them under your pastas, your feet. Bend your knees and let your head be heavy. Good. Find a big breath in and a full breath out. To feel your feet to touch, release the grip. Inhale, the mountain pose. Lift and lengthen arms high to the sky. And this time, exhale, shoulder taps to send your palms to touch and tap behind your head. Good, stay here, lift your gaze. And exhale, forward fold all the way down. Your hands can capture your head on the way down if you like. Finding a little bit more traction. Inhale the halfway lift and lengthen your spine. Exhale to, take, to plank pose. Now listen. Lift your right heel like one legged. And then take a pata chaturanga. So lower down, halfway. Inhale that up. And exhale the downward facing duck. Good. 
This time we're going to hold that ekapada, and you can drop your left knee if you want. So find plank, ekapada, and we're going to find eight push-ups. So let's go. Go down and up, elbows by your side. Right heel stays lifted. For five. For four. For three, right toes high, kick back in two. And one, kick back, right toes high. Exhale, low lunge, step through. Then light. Good. Now drop your back knee. Grab your weights. And with the weights through the shoulders, you're going to find supported triceps. Palms come overhead, knuckles touch each other. Good, we're going to lower the waist and lift them straight up. Exhale. Good, this is your um, hard work, but it's still restored, right? So send your hips forward. Lift with ease. You can always ditch one and wait. Here for eight. Seven. Good, think elbows like um, earmuffs. Super close for four, for three, for two, and one. Listen, plant the weights around your front foot. Now lift your left heel high. Good, standing splits so the weights can hold or be a barrier for your hands. We're gonna rainbow the left leg. Go right and left, good. So gazing towards the back of the room so you can relax your head, but kicking the left heel super high. Good, just think of it as a feather, super light. Floating around, side to side, straight across your mat. Good, keep breathing, eight more. Seven, hoorah. Six, the balance challenge is great. Great for stability, focus on the right foot. Three more. Just two. And one, nice work. Hold your left leg high. And exhale, forward fold. Stay for a breath in. Stay for a breath out. Now grab your weights and rise to one-legged mountain pose. We'll find bird, bicep curls here, so lift your left knee. Good, and we're just gonna lift and lower the palms. Good, a balance challenge. So hold your figure four. I mean, here one legged mountain. Good. Flex the toes. Focus on down and up so the elbows stay close to the rib cage. Good, great job, yeah. It's so good to focus on the balance. Here's eight and seven, six, and five, just four, three, punch your weights high to the sky, in two, and one, send your palms high to the sky, facing each other, now kick your left heel high, facing the front, for four, for three, low flying in two, and one, waist through heart, step your left foot way back, good. Then frame your knee for a narrow row. It's a frame and a pull. Frame and pull. Good. So you're lying on the toes. You can drop your left knee for more support. You can launch forward as well for extra balance challenge. Launch. Exhale. Again, elbows frame the torso. Good. Look like it. A little game, right? So lift. Continue to draw your left hip forward. Good, and just bow your chest to the earth. Yes, you can. Eight more. Seven, stay strong. Six, five, good news, we'll drop the weights in four. Gently lower the weights in three, in two, and one, now lower the weights. Good, inhale through star pose. Exhale to warrior two. Bend your right knee. Good, hold your palms out to the right, good. And let's start with dragging our left knee up. We've been here before. It's super good, the cross body connection. 
Good. We're gonna shuffle to the left in four, in three, in two, and one. So it becomes a new move. It's a shuffle, shuffle, pull. Shuffle, shuffle, pull. Shuffle, shuffle, pull. Shuffle, shuffle, pull. Try to find the joy in the movement. Happy hop, pull. Cross. Can you pick it up? Keep going. You're fierce for four. For three, we're gonna hold to the left. In two, and just focus on the left side. So go, go. Knee up, knee up. For eight, and six. Jumping jacks, in four, in three, in two. Let's go. Open, close. Make your hands clap. Happy hop, happy hop. Open, close. Open, close. You can stay slow as well and do one arm at a time. Or get fancy with the feet. Cross, cross, cross. Keep breathing. There's eight, seven, six, five, just four, just three. Star Jackson, two. And one, it goes like this, like a yay emoji. Go yay, 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 yay. Just eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and have a star. Exhale, white legged forward, fold, fold between your legs. Lower your heart rate, big breath in. Full breath out. Inhale to halfway lift. Exhale, low lunge to the front. So listen. This is gonna be a fun one. Kick your right toes high. Then we're gonna bend the left knee. Hop forward with the left foot. Then keep the right leg lifted and hop up with the right leg still up like one-legged mountain. So it's a one-legged squat thrust. Then hop back, hop forward, hop up. It's tricky. Hop back, hop forward, hop up. It's hard, you got this. Just bend, hop, and jump. Try to keep that right toe off the mat. Good. It doesn't matter how slow you go. Just four more. Woo! Stay strong for three. Try to hover, hover right foot. For two. I know it's hard. Last one. We'll take it for Pada Chaturanga. Flow back. Keep the right toes high. And Chaturanga. Inhale up. Exhale it downward facing back. Then a big breath in. Then a full breath out. Slowly come to your knees. Take a moment to roll out your wrist. Catch your breath. And flip the other way. Good child's pose just for a moment. Knees wide, arms long. Tell yourself, yes, you can. Get one more strong side. Just know, my friends, you are amazing. You've got this. Plant your palms, tuck your toes, and find downward facing dog. Big breath in, big breath out. Inhale, left toes high. Exhale, knee to left shoulder. Inhale, left toes high in the plank. Exhale, chop the down dog with one leg. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left toes high. Exhale, step through, low lunge. Drop your right knee, grab those weights for tricep extensions. Go the weights overhead, lower and lift. So the weights go straight, down and up. Good. Take this, restore with your knee down while you can. Exhale. Good. This is when you channel your perseverance, right? You know we're over halfway. You can do anything for just a few more minutes. Just four more. Here's three. Just two. And one. Listen. Plant your weights to frame your left leg. Let's make the rainbows with our right heel. So standing splits. Tap right and left. 
Try to lift as high as you can. Just tap it tap. Good. Great for the glutes. Good. Eight more. Keep lifting. Can you think of your fall rainbow? Good. So beautiful right now when the sun really hits us in Seattle. Just four more. Just three. And two. You're going to feel so good when you're done with this. You're going to get outside and go for a walk. And one. Forward fold. Big breath in. Big breath out. Good. Slowly rise. This time lifting right knee for one-legged hammer curl. So elbows stay in. Still working the tricep with the uh, biceps. Just lift weights to shoulders and down. It's a balance challenge. Good. Think shoulders to thighs. You can always do one arm at a time. Good. Fire it up. You have eight. Seven. Keep breathing. Six. Five. Yes, you can. Just four. Whew. Just three. Low flying in two. But first, the shoulder press. Press your weights up overhead. Kick your right heel for four. For three. Step your right heel back in two. And one. Step it back. So frame your knee. This time, wide curl. So just like this. Good. Frame your left knee. Good. Stay wide. Hunch over and pull. Go down. Pull up. Lower and lift. Good. This gets your whole shoulder, right? Front and back side. It's working so hard. Good. So weight stay wide in your palms. High on the tippy right toes. You can stay here. Do one arm at a time. Lower the right knee or play with the down and lift the right heel. Good. Six more. It's a little launching pad. Four more. Just three. Ditch the weights in two. And one. Now ditch the weights. Good. Inhale, warrior two. And exhale your arms up overhead. Good. We're going to start pulling our right knee in. Pull. Pull. Then hoorah. For eight. Six. Just four, three, two, and one. It's a hop, hop, pull. Hop, hop, pull. Hop, hop, pull. Good. Keep breathing. Keep pulling. For four. Hop. Three. Two. Let's hold to the right and pull. Elbows to knee. Find the joy in this. For eight, seven, six, five. Jumping jacks in three, in two, and one. It's an out, in. Good. Make your thighs up. Open, close. You can step it out. Forget fancy feet. Crisscross. Wherever you are, how big can your arms go? Stay with me. Hop, hop. For eight, seven, six, five. Star jacks in four, in three, in two, and one. Like a yay emoji, right? Yay, yay. For eight, and six, just four, three, two, and one. Star pose. Exhale, wide forward, fold. Catch your breath, big breath in. Big breath out. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, low lunge. Let's try eight of those crazy floating one-legged squat thrusts. Inhale, left toes high. Bend your right knee. Exhale, hop forward with your right foot. Keep your left leg lifted. Rise to one-legged mountain and hop. Oh, I know, it's tricky. I'm gonna find it a little bit faster. So hop back, hop forward. Hop up. Six more. Try to keep your left toes hovered. It's okay if you fall out like me. It's a challenge, right? It's not perfection. We work hard and keep showing up to improve. Two more. This is the last one right here. 
We'll find one legged chaturanga. Inhale. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Slowly come down to your knees. Good. Inhale your right arm high. And exhale, thread the needle. Send your right cheek to the mat. Send your left arm long. Big breath in. Big breath out. Whew. Plant your left palm. Inhale, right arm high. Exhale, lower it down. Inhale, left arm high. Exhale, thread the needle. Left cheek comes down, right arm long. Big breath in, big breath out. Slowly lift your left arm high, big breath in. Exhale, lower it down. Come to a tall seat. Bend half toward this pose. Send your palms to the touch, cross your thumbs. Bicep straighten the ears, big breath in. And exhale, fold all the way down. Keep your elbows lifted to find traction of the spine. Drawing your pinkies in. Try to rest your forehead on the earth. Engage your core and slowly lift your arms with your gaze. And exhale against the heart. Namaste, Yogi. Wow, Yogi, so that was... Um... A glow maker, right? Man, I hope that you enjoyed hopping around with me and that we have uh, just a few more days left. So make sure that you find time to restore. You totally deserve it.